I'm so happy you're here, Fred, and so delighted when you make time for us. Obviously, you're very busy. Uh, very exciting. Uh, the season three of our show documentary now is airing right now. People yeah. can check that out on IFC. Yeah. One of the many reasons that you were so busy, and you were saying to me the downside of being busy, and there aren't many, is that you used to read a ton. Uh, you were a huge, uh, voracious reader of fiction, and you do not have time to read anymore. No, never have any time. But because of that, you developed a process wherein you can look at the cover of a book, and from the cover alone, you can glean the entire plot, all the characters, <laughs> and with that one glance, uh, one glance, be as rewarded as I would be from reading the entire book. Exactly, beginning to end, the wow. whole thing. Yeah. Do you mind if we try it one more time? Please. All right, everybody, uh, we're gonna test that again in a segment we call Fred Judges a Book by Its Cover. <laughs> Okay, here we go. This is The Girl Who Lived by Christopher Grayson. Fred, what is this book about? The, oh, this is um, The Girl Who Lived. Uh-huh. And um, I would describe it as a thrilling suspense novel. Right, so right, there's yeah, a lot of suspense. Yeah, sir. And um, so Christopher Grayson wrote it, yep, and yep, he wrote right, it on yep. a vacation. And um, he was inspired by uh, this time that he went to um, this amusement park. Uh-huh. And so with this book, uh, I can, I can uh, uh, sort of glean from this is that it's about um, an amusement park that they forgot to build a roller coaster. They just <laughs> forgot. And it was just, they, it just slipped their minds. They're like, we're going to make a concession stand. We're going to build all this stuff. And so the first person shows up, and I'm going to wear my great red coat, and I'm going to get on this roller coaster, and they're like, will you do us a favor? Will you please pretend like you're on a roller coaster? Just jump up and down in the field, and... And we'll just try to get people to come, but if you don't, we are begging you, please, <laughs> just jump. And she does this, and the amusement park is a huge hit. Wow! It's a huge hit because Because they her... see this one girl in a red coat, and they think, that looks really fun. Yes, yes. She did such a good job. The only thing is, she just kept going and going and going, and she sort of disappears for a while, and then ends up back around the world at <laughs> the beginning of... So... Like a roller coaster. Like, like a roller coaster. <laughs> so... Yeah, it, it is the girl who lived. Wow, that's it. Give it, give it up for Fred Armisen. I gotta check this out. Yeah.